Hey guys, I'm Sean the Bro, and we're back. This time for an achievement in Halo 4. Uh, no one left behind. No man left behind. Something like that. Um, Alright, so I'm talking over this. I didn't uh, do a live commentary, but I'll show you how to do it. I want you to warn you in advance. Um, as I am the host, for some reason, everything I did was delayed. So, when you see a lot of my shots are off, that's not actually making me bad. But once it's not. It's a straightforward rescue up. Still, if it's UNSC, it really is save its ass. Just the it's a cubby. But anyway, um, I recommend doing this with two people. Uh, because I tried it several times with one. It's kind of hard to keep track of all the things. Honestly. Say, so, like, I'm sorry to interrupt myself, but that rocket that I shot, that was so bad because everything I shoot is really so. Anyway, uh, I recommend doing this with two people because it definitely helps a lot when you need to focus on keeping one thing alive. And I did it before I had the Wraith was killing the Wraith, which I took out. But then I would die because the elites were there. It was just too much of trouble. Um, so I, you don't have to. However, to do what we do in this guide, it's recommended that you do. Anyway, so you're gonna basically just go to each marine location at the start. So, just make your way around the base and round them all up. No sounds stupid, but the commands actually have a lot of health and will help you fight a lot of the battles. Um, an obvious tip, make sure you don't shoot them in the middle. Seems easy. Sometimes you panic because you think they're gonna die and them. Maybe that's just me, but the point is, try not to kill them. Um, you can go to any of these things, the supply boxes, I guess. They give you shotguns, rockets, DMRs, and all those things. Uh, hunters. Hunters take out with plasma grenades and whatever weapon. I'm using the shotgun because I know that works well against them. But definitely recommend plasma grenades or rockets for them. Because a lot of the times when we were doing it, this is our first time doing it, but a lot of times when I was doing it, uh, the hunters would kill the marines in one hit. So, anyway, you're gonna clear out all the enemies, and as you see, all the marines are still alive. Then, you're gonna go by the enemy. Crimson, clear the tower of any covenant and give Dalton's people somewhere to park. This phantom comes by. There's a phantom headed your way. Try to get behind it. Somehow, um, I don't think this was delay. I just, I could not board him. I know it said it. I don't know, but anyway, see my teammate he gets on there because he's controlling that event. Take out the wraith and you'll get all these red arrows. So these are the enemies you have to kill. If you can do this far, then you're pretty much safe enough that you won't have a problem with it, I should say. This is kind of the hardest part. Uh, because there are elites everywhere. If you are doing this with a friend, do keep in mind that um, usually the gameplay is delayed for one of you. Because I know when my friend was hosting it, his game was delayed. So I don't know what's up with that, but do keep in mind that if someone, if you want to do this with somebody, make sure that uh, you're ready for that, because that's actually a lot more than that. And here's the worst part. These guys with swords come in, again, a lot easier than to play. And they will instantly kill anyone who they hit, as far as I know. Every time I've seen them hit someone, they do get killed by it. That was my teammate getting killed by it. So you're gonna want to take everyone out. I recommend picking up a sword because then you can take out elites along the way. And elites are somewhat of a pain. Just a few you have to put decent amount of bullets into them, which is time wasted if you're trying to protect people. Eventually, the phantoms will flee, and you'll want to go up on top of the base, but. 
we sat down here to make sure there really weren't anybody left. Or any uh, enemies here. left, I mean. Alright, Crimson, your ride's inbound. Fall back to the LZ. Okay. And when we enter the tower, there's a guy on a turret. He's not a big deal, but. Uh, on heroic, that's relatively strong, so. Just be in your guard. Right here. He's taken out the so. Then up here, once you get up here, you're good. Uh, let's see, after flag. Um, once you get up here, you're pretty good. All of the Marines, as far as I know, are oh, still alive bad. at this point. Speed it out, Miller. I didn't see it. Multiple uh, inbound on Crimson's ever, position. I can't prove that, Multiple. But well, that's just grab the Spartan laser. I need way more than that. So I need to be Crimson. My friend has gone for that, so I decided to use a weapon in case of Should be pretty well stocked. And it's pretty easy from this point on because the Marines don't get attacked except by the infantry. And there will be any Marines come up here, so this is where all the infantry is dropped. So if what I said just makes sense then really you don't have any problem with this one. It's pretty straightforward. As long as you don't die, because if both of you, if both you and partner, or just you die, uh, they will go and pass down there. Uh, once you take him out, you'll get the achievement. Well, once you kill him, you have to take out the man. Textbook example uh, of kicking ass. I go up on the well done, Crimson. That's everyone. Crimson, you can head to the evac point. And there we go. Um, as far as I know, no one was killed, however, made no differently. There's the achievement. And finally, as the last thing, guys, Skyrim is up, however, it's processing. So it won't be in your subscriptions. You might still be able to see it. I don't know exactly where the cutoff is, is where you can see it, but it's not up yet. Um, it's uploaded, I'm but it's not processed, so it'll be up Crimson. very shortly. Maybe Come on home. And of course, Call of Duty Black Ops 2. So games are, uh, videos are going to be coming out on that game. So I'll see you later, bros.